Dear members of the Parliamentary Assembly of the Council of Europe, I hope you understand that we, the citizens of Ukraine, have a better understanding of what is actually happening in our Ukrainian Crimea and our Ukrainian Donbass. Each of you, dear colleagues, who do not openly call Russia the aggressor, you are not just compromising with your conscience, but you also share the responsibility for the murders in, uh, of Ukrainian soldiers uh, and volunteers, killing civilians and occupying the territory in the tradition of Hitler, destroying infrastructure in Donbass. By the way, are you ready to answer for the crimes of Putin, Mr. Ahramund? If not, why then do you want to return Russian delegation by all means? Let us not be afraid to tell the truth. Putin is a killer, uh, and he is responsible for the uh, rivers of uh, bloodshed in Ukraine and Syria. And the whole civilized world must unite in a real fight and countering the aggressor. Rather than follow the path of appeasement and concessions to him, taking as an example how Daladier and Chamberlain had made concession to Hitler. Unfortunately, uh, Monsieur Hollande yesterday's statement shows that the French president goes by Daladier and considers it's necessary to concede Putin. According to Monsieur Hollande, uh, it's uh, necessary to hold the elections in Donbass and only after that restore the borders of Ukraine, which is a big mistake. Uh, I, member of Radical Party of Oleg Leshko, we say, not to elections in Donbass. How can people vote under the muzzle of, of guns? It will be the same circus uh, as so-called referendum uh, in, uh, in Crimea. If you support holding election in Donbass before the borders are restored, you support Putin's plan to destroy Ukraine. This way Putin is trying to legalize terrorists. Uh, is this what European community had to do? Legalize the, uh, the terrorists? Aren't you ashamed to seek police in Putin instead of requiring immediate release of Ukrainian political prisoners in Russia? Mikola Karpiuk, Stanislav Klich, Oleg Sensov, Alexander Kolchenko and others. The path of a peace and aggressor is the path of self-destruction of Europe. Can you understand this at last? I would also want to draw your attention to the blatant abuse of the Ukrainian Orthodox Church of Kyiv Patriarchate on the territory controlled by Russian authorities. Uh, yesterday, Bishop Clement gave a clear evidence of how Ukrainian Orthodox are persecuted in the Crimea, and Ukrainian Church has to be destroyed by the decision of the local Kurd in Noginsk near Moscow. Thank you.